Hello and welcome to Jamaica. My name is Jason and today I'll be your tour guide showing you off some culture and fun places to visit in Jamaica. On your left here, you can see Duns River Falls and Park. Climbing the waterfalls is a popular tourist activity and is often, but not exclusively, performed with the help of tour guides from the park. It takes about one to one and a half hours to climb with short breaks for photographs, videos, and recordings taken by the guides. On to our next stop. Right in front of you, you will see the Rose Hall Great House. Rose Hall is a Jamaican Georgian plantation house now run as a historic house museum. It is located in Montego Bay, Jamaica, with a panoramic view of the coast. Thought to be one of the country's most impressive plantation great houses, it had fallen into the ruins by 1960s, but was then restored. The museum showcases the slave history of the estate and the legend of the White Witch of Rose Hall. Let's continue along with some facts about Jamaica. The weather in Jamaica is warm all year round, but the best time to visit is November to mid-December. The weather is high 70s to mid 80s all year round. The island's native language is English. The local dialects combines elements of other languages from Spanish and African dialects to Irish, British, and American phrases. The original inhabitants of Jamaica are believed to be the Arawaks, also called Tianos. They came from South America 2,500 years ago and named the island Jamaica, which means land of food and water. Some interesting facts are Jamaica has the fastest runners on earth. They also produce the most music, they have the most churches per square mile, they also have the most rum bars per square mile. One of the most famous dishes in Jamaica is jerk chicken, a fiery chicken dish that combines the heat of scotch, bonnet peppers with other spices like thyme, pepper, cinnamon, cloves, and allspice. Another popular dish to try while you're in Jamaica might require a bit of courage, but if you want authentic cuisine, then you've got to sample the local goat head soup and the cow foot stew. On average, a tourist in Jamaica will spend $100 a day. And here's the hotel you'll be staying at. This is Strawberry Hill, one of the nicest hotels in all of Jamaica. It even has a pool and spa. Anyways, this will conclude our tour for Jamaica. I hope you will enjoy your stay.